So as you guys know, I've been using the HyperX Cloud Core headset. This headset here has served me great. Um, I think I paid 80 bucks for these at GameStop quite a while ago, right after I upgraded my PC the last time. But you see here, the, the build on HyperX headsets is second to none, in my opinion, compared to a lot of other gaming headsets out there. You look at some of these Turtle Beaches, and they just look, they're just cheaply made, very poorly made. I just bought my kids a set of Turtle Beaches a while back, and to be honest with you, I wouldn't use them. <laughs> but for kids who are gonna tear them up, that's what they get right now. But these Cloud Cores right here, an amazing headset. Um, you get your adapter that plugs right into your PC, and they're good for Xbox One, PC, PS4, and I believe the Switch if you wanna deal with uh, jumping through hoops. But as you can see, I mean, you've got your HyperX embroidered. The quality on this headset is stellar. They're still 80 bucks from what I see. You can probably find them cheaper on uh, eBay or Amazon. But from what I see, they're still running for about 80 bucks. And they're stellar. Uh, the only thing I was noticing, I made my last Red Dead video. I think it was the impressions video. And this mic right here just sounded, it didn't sound good to me. So I don't know if it's just the mic or if it is going bad, I don't know. But all of HyperX is the build quality, as I stated earlier, you got your foam here. Very comfortable, very, very great quality headset for the money. Now that being said, I was noticing the mic issues and I was starting to notice that when I was talking, it was crackling, popping, and I was noticing there wasn't quite enough noise cancellation. I could hear the TV in the living room when uh, the wife was in there playing and, and all this kind of thing. So I decided it was time for an upgrade. I didn't like the fact there was no volume control on the, on the cloud cores. I decided it was time for an upgrade, and upon doing some research, I found the HyperX Cloud Alpha. So many videos, so many people saying that this headset for a hundred bucks sounds better than some of these two hundred to two hundred and fifty dollar uh, headsets out there. Plus, it's got the control, the volume control, the mixer or whatever on the on the actual cord. It's got uh, dual. Well, I don't want to tell you guys wrong on that but it's got where's it at here da -da. yeah dual chamber okay so it's got your dual chamber drivers which mixes up your mid your mid range your treble your bass all of that helps to keep that um going to where you know you can hear the footsteps behind you you're not going to get snuck up on quite as easy so i went with these 100 bucks not a bad price at all because i'm not one of these guys that's going to go out and really want to spend, say, $250 on a gaming headset. I think that's just, it's crazy. Plus, not to mention, when you're hearing that these sound just as good as those sets, why in the hell would I want to do that? So, we're going to do a little unboxing, then I'm going to play with these for a little while today. The box is super sick. I'm going to play with these for a little while today, and then I'm going to do, I'm going to add my impressions at the end of this uh, particular video. Let's see if we can get these babies open first of all all right I'm not even seeing there we go so the box super sick I'm digging that box uh, let's see HyperX has you covered got issues with your product conduct our team one of them one of those deals um, just a little card tells you welcome to join in the HyperX family. Like I said, HyperX headsets, guys. Turtle Beaches, people used to love those. Um, in, in my opinion, they're just not what they were. So, if you're going to spend the money, you don't want to buy the expensive Astros, which I'm hearing the revolvers, the, the HyperX revolver, which they didn't have in stock. Uh, when I just went to check, I heard that those are competing with Astros. Don't quote me on that because I don't know for sure. The build quality on these, again, guys, it's it's awesome. I mean, even with the lower end model here, it's going to compete a little bit. Matter of fact, that's actually embroidered, and this isn't. I kind of like the embroidered a little bit better, but got your drivers here. 
obviously you've got your plugins for your mic and uh, your actual sound and then you know we got to do you know we got to do this guys you know we got to do the peel <laughs> but no man the brushed aluminum these things feel so much better than my cloud cores already the brushed aluminum the color i know it may look orange to you guys that's what i thought when i first seen them but it actually is a nice finish like a brushed red almost a maroon but man these things right here they feel nice i can't wait to try these out as far as in the box obviously obviously you're going to get your mic to attach and i thought that these were supposed to come yeah we got another box here let's see what's in this box so this is supposed to come with yes okay so here is let's move this it's gonna be your cable obviously here you got your mute you got your mic off on mute and your volume controls for your levels there and they also came with this this here this also was with my cloud core so this makes them pc compatible you plug these two ends into your pc plug the headset into this cord and it looks like it's pretty long actually which is which is cool my other one was long so it's probably about the same i would imagine so yeah you get that and then if you decided to take them on the go you get this little hyper x bag that would also be good for cleaning screens, but you can see it's got the HyperX logo on it. The quality that you get from HyperX for the money is unbelievable. So I'm going to try these out, guys. I'm going to binge on some Red Dead today over on Twitch. Feel free to join me over there today. Um, and I will be back a little bit later with an actual audio. I'm going to try to do a mic test if I can to uh, let you guys have a little more in-depth review. But I'm going to see you guys in a little bit. All right, guys. So we're going to run a quick mic test i don't know how well this is going to come out but right now i'm talking on my cloud cores and like i said in my last video i believe it was my red dead impression video i could tell that the sound quality of the of the cloud cores had either i don't know i don't know if they've always sounded like that i've never had anybody tell me that uh, it sounded bad but to me it just it didn't sound good at all it sounded like it had a lot of reverb and just almost robotic I didn't really I didn't really like it so I don't know if you guys can tell but these are the cloud cores and now we're gonna plug in the cloud alphas alright guys these are the cloud alphas I'm hoping <laughs> I watched a lot of reviews earlier today and on the reviews the mic sounded a lot better than the cores um, did so this right here is the cloud alpha mic test let me know what you guys think as far as mic quality down in the comment section and I'll be back with a full basically review very shortly of the uh, headset in general as far as the bass and how they sound in game I'll holler at you guys in a little bit all right guys so we got some good gaming in with black ops and we got some good uh, red dead uh, missions ran to test the actual sound quality of the headset and I gotta say they're awesome uh, the bass is definitely very very rich um, I love how you can adjust the sound because with the cores you just plug them in and that's what you get other than the microphone or the headset volume in the uh, console settings. But uh, yeah, the, the dual drivers, you can definitely tell a difference between these and my cores as far as your mids, your trebles, your bass, the ambient sounds all sound excellent. Uh, when you're playing multiplayer, you can hear people coming, that kind of thing. Um, as far as Red Dead goes, the little animals in the background and, and the footsteps and things like that definitely stand out so if you're playing with these on Xbox I would imagine this goes with any headset but one of the first things I noticed immediately was when I turned on Windows Sonic uh, for uh, headphones in the audio settings in Xbox they sounded so much better so much more rich it just sounded a lot better so a little pro tip for you I would highly recommend turning that on if you're planning on um, Matter of fact, with any headset, turn that on and you will be blown away by the difference. But right now, I gotta say guys, I highly recommend the HyperX Cloud Alphas. So awesome so far. I love the uh, upgrade, how much better they sound than my Cloud Cores. Can't wait to dive in and play a lot more stuff and uh, make some videos and see what the mic's all about 
uh, for sure on this headset. But that's all I got for you guys. I'm going to holler at you guys later. Chime off in the comments. I'm out.